years after I played it before, so. Deep in the forest of Albion lay the small town of Oakvale, unchanged by time and untouched by the sword. Or now. Here lived a boy and his family, a boy dreaming of greatness, of one day being a hero. Heroic boy. Sometimes he imagined himself as a noble knight or a powerful wizard. And other times he dreamt he'd be an evil warrior. But in all his dreams of greatness, he could not possibly imagine the power of the destiny that lay before him. Come on, wake up. Daydreaming again, were you? Just like your mother, mind always wandering. Well, let it wander off to find your sister, will you? She's out playing by the Barrow Fields gate. Remember, you haven't given her a birthday present yet. Don't tell me you forgot to get her one. Well, I'm not bailing you out this time, son. Hmm. I tell you what, I'll give you a gold piece for each good deed you do around Oakvale. That should be enough to buy her a present. Now, get moving and stay out of trouble. So, as a pre, you know, precaution, um, I've decided, similar to what I did when I replayed Mass Effect, I'm going to play straight up douchebag this playthrough of Fable. So I'm going to do lots of bad things because I think it's kind of funny. So we'll see. Uh, see what happens. Also, I'm pretty sure this game is Xbox X enhanced and it looks really good, so... Can I punch this child? Can I punch the child! I want to punch the child! No, I can't punch the child, damn it. Oh, well. Um... Alright, so let's go wander around and see what I can find to do. pumpkin. Oh, what? Uh, I, I was just um. I, I've never even met this woman. Who is she? Look, oh. Sonny, keep your mouth shut about this, right? My wife's at home with our little ones, and I'm supposed to be working. But, but a man should be entitled to do what he likes, don't you think? Tell you what, if you keep this little secret, I'll give you a gold piece. Oh, you will, will you? Good lad. Here, have this gold piece. Thank you. My advice to you, don't get tied down to one woman. Uh. Look after yourself. Forget everyone else. Right off the bat, I've committed an evil deed. Woot. Alright. Off to a good start. Um, let's see what other terrible things I can do. Can I talk to this child? I've lost Rosie! Oh, yeah. I left her, and I can't remember where. Her stuffing needs changing today, and I can't find her. Please help! She's a lovely little furry bear with a blue patch on her back. Okay. I gotta look for the teddy bear. I know there's an evil thing you could do with the teddy bear, too. I remember what, though. Hello, lad. I'm a took some little girl I saw, and it seems you haven't got her a present yet. It just so happens I that not. I have a rather nice box of sweets here. Guaranteed to put a smile on any sister's face for only three gold pieces. Maybe later. Remember, three right. gold coins, that's all they cost. Stock available! Right. Well, I need to He's a naughty get one for sure. I think I get Honestly, gold for talking where's that to filthy layabout husband of mine? Her. <laughs> With some woman, I don't doubt. I run his house, bring up his children, and what do I get in return? Nothing. If you find him, let me know, won't you? I mean, I took his bribe, but I'm also you gonna have? tell her about right. her husband. I'm gonna turn him into Balvary. Thank you, young. So I, 
<laughs> I balanced out Look, the... Nick, right, got you, you little... R I've heard reports that you... Accessory to imp... That sort of behavior is... If you were older, you'd... You need to decide. I'll leave it at that. Oh, I'm gonna be a douche. Uh, what else can I do? That's the... I probably shouldn't have done that, because that's... That was a good thing, and I'm trying to be bad. I'm trying to be a straight-up douche. Uh, yeah, chicken kicker. Um, What do you want? I'm just dealing with this brat. He was irritating me, playing with my sister and her stupid teddy bear. No, he won't give it to me, just because I said I'd rip his stupid head off. I told him if he doesn't do what I say, I'm going to make his life a misery. Are you? <laughs> Get him off me! He goes around the town beating up anyone smaller than him. But you look strong. you half his pocket money if you let me have her. Whoa! Yeah. Thanks. You and I got a lot in common. Here, take his money as a reward for returning her to me. Now, Rosie, what game shall we play? Huh? Teddy no legs? What about burning fur? I did commit a bad deed. I'm a You're bad, bad boy. Idiot. What other things can I do that are bad? Oh, oh, thank goodness. Listen, lad, could you do? Uh -oh. I've got to, you know, answer a cup. Just stand between those two stacks and don't move. I'll put a good word in for you when. Right, won't be. He's gotta go pee. My cuff, quick, while he's away. Unless you're too scared. Unless you're just a big blubbing girl. Come on. Let's go oh. and break stuff. <laughs> Are you just going to stand there We're like a lemon? To... Yeah, smash him up. <laughs> I'm not good at... You shouldn't leave me alone, Isn't this dude. more fun? Yes, it is. Oh, no. Come on, punch the barrel. That's more like it. So I can go... I did one good deed, so I guess I could talk to my dad and get one good deed. Otherwise, I was a douche, though. What? You again? I'm hearing of your mischief rather regularly. Shall we remind ourselves? 
Oh, I'm very mischievous. The destruction of a person's vendables, dereliction of sentry duty, despite having been asked nicely, violent conduct towards a person or persons without guard's permission, giving of a teddy bear to a person likely to rip off its head, accessory to improper man and lady behaviour. Do you realise the trouble you'd be in if you weren't such a little un? Oh, I don't now care. Now go and douche. kick yourself out of trouble. Uh, no, I'm not because I am a bad, bad boy. Mm. I'm not sure what I to make of you, you, lad. You can tell what, what I kid. want. Where's my dad? Hmm. I'm a man of my word, but if you think that I'll turn a blind eye to you... Look, try to keep out of trouble. Well, I think you may have enough there. Ah, I have four coins now. Not that I needed it, but... I literally did everything bad except for I did... <laughs> I did the thing practical. I... I told, took the bribe and that ran it up. Know the difference between right like and wrong. Ooh, you lucky officer. Quickly, give me food. Sure. Young sir, you go, they are the yours. Coins. Wish your sister a happy birthday from me now, won't you? You are a creepy dude. Your giant handlebar mustache. All right. I guess I better go visit my sister. That that boy don't know the don't come right back, the chicken. There we go. Die. <laughs> Let's see. Here we go. Something different about that boy. He's an I'm awesome. All these feathers just flying everywhere. There we go. Oh, that's right, you can run. I forgot you could. Uh, can I beat up the scarecrow? My sister, Hello, little brother. Sissy. I hope you haven't forgotten what day it is, like you did last year. I'm sorry if I woke you up last night. It was another of those dreams. Guess what day it is? I was Guess standing what day in this it field is? when something happened, but I can't remember what. Never mind that though. I'm still waiting for my present. Give me just a moment, actually, because I have to do something. I knew you were going to bring me chocolates. It's just like my dream. Come on, let's go home. Mother will be back for my party any minute now. Wait, there's something wrong. Bandits! <sighs> It's really happening. They're here. You've got to hide. Got one. Evil had come to Oakvale. Bandits wielding torches and steel, slaying and burning all in their path. Blood-red flames lit the night as the villagers screamed and begged for mercy, and soon their bodies filled the streets. Then the raiders reached the last house, where the boy and his family lived. It was them they had slaughtered so many to find. The father fought to protect his kin, but he was no warrior, and fell mortally wounded. The bandits ripped the house apart, but could not find the boy. Through torture and threats, his mother and sister remained silent. And
and their furious attackers took them both. From the nearby woods, the boy watched as all he knew was taken away. His whole life was crushed to ashes. He was alone. Sorry, I wasn't talking. Uh, the first trailer for The Lion King just dropped, so I had to watch that, and it looks freaking good. Anyway, uh, my village is on fire. Oh shit, I better run. Let's, uh, let's go. Oh, not that way, I'm not. Barbarian douchebags killed my family and destroyed my village. I'm pissed. Further driving me to being evil is this bloodthirsty rage for vengeance. That's that's the justification I will take for me. Besides the fact that I'm just kind of a douche kid, you know. No, my dad is dead. <laughs> We must leave. It's not safe here. They're all dead. You don't want to join them, do you? Then Maybe give me your hand. Okay, random stranger. Please don't take me into your van. Let's, let's go. Mystical portal! Or beat me up, Scotty. One of the two. You'd have a stronger stomach than that. Come on. <sighs> Save your energy, boy. It's not me you want to fight. You might not realize it, but I just saved your life. There's nothing left for you in Oakvale. And if you'd stayed, you'd be as dead as the rest of them. Come with me. My name is Maze. And I'm the head of the Guild of Heroes. You must have heard of it. You'll find nowhere safer in all of Albion, nor a better place to call your home. And if it's vengeance you want, you'll need the training only we can offer. Here we are. I'll introduce you to the Guildmaster. He'll be your guide from now on. Kidoki. I have a new student for you. Put him in the dorm upstairs with the girl. You don't look much like hero ah. material to me, but Maze knows what he's doing, I suppose. Well, follow me then. Old bald guy. My hero. As I slowly You'll be sharing this room with upstairs. Whisper, one of our brightest young pupils. She's playing in the woods right now, but you'll meet her in the morning. For now, you should Not get important. some sleep. Your training starts tomorrow. Okay, well. <laughs> I'm apparently too emotional to think about it, so... It's time to wake up! You must be my roommate. Hmm. Shorter than I expected. My name's Whisper. I've been here for a month. Had the room to myself till now, too. But that's alright. You know you talk in your sleep. Sounded like a bad nightmare. Happens to a lot the first week. Some don't even last that long. You won't either if you don't get moving. The Guildmaster is waiting for us in the map room. You don't want to be late on your first day. Follow me. 
Okay, that won't be. Hmm. Looks like the Guildmaster got tired of waiting for you. He's probably at the training grounds across the river. Let's go! Okay. Ah, this I still is the have guild shop. Hey, you when you're today? older, you can buy stuff here. I probably should go the other way, not that way. Though, from what I remember, the guild shop was pretty crappy. Like, it didn't have a lot of good. Find the dudes who you race to uh, get to the demon door. Ooh, an apple. Yes. You There's the guild master. All right, lad. It's time to see if you've any potential. Get in the ring. Now, okay. I want you to hit that dummy as hard as you can. Just keep oh, going until it. I tell you to stop. I'm not making much of an impact there, are you? Here, try with this. Hey, a stick. Whoops. Ah, now that's more like it. When you destroy an enemy like this dummy, it drops an experience orb. These orbs contain the knowledge gained from killing the creature. It's very important that you collect these orbs, or you won't learn anything. Now oh, pick no. it up. I want to, though. Well done, Got it, lad. I guess. Now then, tomorrow we'll... That's the guild alarm. Sounds like there might be something loose in the woods. This is a good opportunity to test your spirit. I'll wait for you at the Guildwood's entrance while you deal with the problem. Once you're done, we can talk about starting your training. Something over here. Oh, bugs. Bugs scream. that water though that's not a rich boy thing apparently all right well I'm going back to the heroes guild because I, I did my task I got my thing done yay
Good work, lad. Those beetles can be a damn nuisance. Here, I think you've earned yourself some pocket money for that. If you want more gold, I'm sure the servants could use your help with something. Or you can get an early night. Come and see me when you're ready. You look tired after killing those beetles. I want to do that demon door race. Where are those guys who are complaining with the demon door? There they are. We're discussing whether I'm the fastest apprentice. I ran to the demon door and back in 50 seconds. Beat that. Oh, I will. Right then, get to the demon door and back and talk to me in 50 seconds. I did it in 50 seconds. No one has beaten that. Yeah, well, if it wasn't for my injured leg, I'd beat that time. You look tired after killing those beetles. Oh, that's not where I'm supposed to go, shit. Demon doors that way, okay. What's this chest? Arrogant, that's for sure. Come on, come on. No, you're not. That's a... Ah, I did it! Nailed it. That showed you, didn't it? <laughs> Competitions? Ah, well, you didn't that time. Face the truth. You are that quick. But if I'm not the you fastest, I must be that. the best at something. Uh, who else can I talk to? I think there's one other person I can talk to. Get a little bit more money. 
Is it the lady who's looking for apples? Mm, listen, I have to make an apple pie for the... But I can't find any more. If you find enough, can you... I have them already. Thanks. Thank you so much. Here, have the... There, I got blueberry pie. There we go. Oh, yeah. Let's look around at different things. Thank you so much, hero. Aw, oh, you know, I'm just being me. Ooh, is that an apple? Oh, but I can't take it, damn it. Um, what other task can I do? Something over here. That's true. Oh, it's those guys. Okay, well, I got a blueberry pie and I got some money, so... I think it's time to leave childhood behind and become an apprentice. My childhood days are over. You look tired. Right, Your Shmizaru. training is about to begin. Oh, I'm ready. The guild Let's do this, was now boss. the boy's life. The memory of the Oakvale Flames still scorched his mind, but soon he had no thought other than training, and he became stronger and more agile with every passing year. His days were filled with grueling exercises, the nights with study in the library. Finally, he was ready to become a guild apprentice, just as Mays had foreseen. The real training was about to begin.